Hey guys, um, I'm JD from The Shrugs. I just wanted to say a little bit today about cajones. Um, these are cajones. I have three, as you can see. And a cajon is the National Instrument of Peru, and it's spelled C-A-G-O-N. I just wanted to go through some of the different ones I have and the different songs that they make. Um, yeah, first, this one. This is a cruise cajon, new and improved cruise cajon by Heidi Joubert from cajonbox.com. Um, this is very good. All these are great, but this is very good for kind of uh, flamenco kind of stuff. Um, so I suppose maybe a rumba. And uh, yeah, I use, I, use, I use this a lot. Well, I use all of them a lot, but I, I use this a lot. Um, I suppose I'll, I'll move to the next one. Um, this one is a heartbeat for worship cajon from William Johnson and bottomcajones.com. Um, this is this is kind of cool because it's it's specially designed for gospel music, and it's it's a bit quieter than the other two maybe. Um, so it's it's good for um, swing maybe. Uh, and you can hear the slap. The slap is nice and kind of muted. It's not too overpowering. And the bass is uh, quite muffled. And just to compare, I'm just going to play the bass on this one. Just to compare the two, because I, I really like how different the bass is on this one too. It's quite quite a lot deeper. Um, another thing I really like about this cajon is the fact that when you turn it around to the other side, these are called... Uh, front plates and this this is a Peruvian original Peruvian cajon so it's, it's good for kind of um, uh, authentic more traditional beats such as the Faith Fastejo that kind of thing um, yeah so maybe I'll move to this one This is the final one, this is a Duende. I think they've actually changed their logo now. I think it's like a windmill. No, it's, it's different. I don't think it's that anymore. This is the first one I got anyway. Um, and this this is quite a bit louder. This, you know, this would suit kind of rock, rock kind of stuff. Uh. You can hear that there's, there's a, quite a crack from the snare. Quite a kind of deep bass. So if you need to cut through electric guitar, well, not electric guitars, but if you need to cut through guitars and things like that, this would be your one. Um, it's also quite good for um, glissandos or foot slides, where you, you kind of get a different tone by maybe playing with brushes and moving your foot up and down the cajon. That's about it, really. Um, I suppose, in terms of people that I like to look at, educators on the internet, um, you have Paul Jennings at playcohone.com, and you have Heidi Heidi Joubert at, at cohonebox.com, and Ross McCallum as well is another great guy. Um, yeah, I'm just going to finish up maybe by playing a few different beats and different ones again. Um, this is this is the dog's beat by Paul Jennings. And a bit of funk. Um, you think? 
Suka, I'm telling you. thing before you go um, you can also play kind of with your knuckles on the side of the uh, on the side of cajones so um that kind of thing or um some some brazilian some brazilian samba uh, Thanks very much, check out those guys and if you have any questions you can email the shrugs at gmail.com um, and check us out on Facebook and Twitter and thanks to everyone who's kind of giving us support on Twitter. Um, I just mentioned a couple of people because there's loads of people. Um, Roger from Port Break and Pat from Festival and Gigway and Debarra's Folk Club and Clan and Ross and Paul and um, yeah, I'll see you in the new year. Oh yeah, happy Christmas. <laughs>